Welcome to Quiz Class. On this channel, we test your brain while you're having fun. If you like the quiz, please thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe. Enjoy! What was the title of the song by The Foundations? Written by Mike Dabo and Tony McCauley. Build Me Up Buttercup? Baby Now That I've Found You? Or Silence is Golden? Build Me Up Buttercup is the answer. Who was the original singer of How Sweet It Is to Be Loved by You? Stevie Wonder, James Taylor, or Marvin Gaye? Marvin Gaye. What song of Otis Redding was released less than a month after he died? These arms of mine, sitting on the dock of the bay, don't worry, be happy. Sitting on the dock of the bay. In which year did the monkeys release the song, I'm a Believer? 1962, 1966, or 1964? I'm a Believer was released in 1966. What is the title of The Who's debut single? I Can't Explain, Pinball Wizard, Behind Blue Eyes. Their debut single was, I Can't Explain. Who was originally offered a chance to sing Son of a Preacher Man? Dusty Springfield, Norma Tanega, Aretha Franklin. The answer, Aretha Franklin. No multiple choices. Fill in the blank the lyrics from the song Stand By Me by Ben King. And the blank is the only light we'll see. And the moon is the only light we'll see. Again, no multiple choice. Who is Jimmy Dean's inspiration for the song, Big Bad John? He was inspired by John Minto. Which musical duo released the song, Unchained Melody, in 1955? The Everly Brothers, The Ronettes, The Righteous Brothers. That was the Righteous Brothers. What was the genre of Mustang Sally, written and first recorded by Mac Rice? R&B, country music, or disco? Mustang Sally was R&B. Who released the song, To Love Somebody, in 1967? Air Supply, Cool and the Gang, or the Bee Gees? That was released by the Bee Gees. Who was Sonny's duet partner in the song, I Got You Babe? Georgia, Cher, or Sophie? His partner was Cher. In which year did Led Zeppelin release their debut album? 1961, 1967, or 1969. Their debut album came out in 1969. No multiple choices here. Fill in the blank the lyrics from the song God Only Knows by the Beach Boys. Will life would still go on, blank me. Believe me. Again, no multiple choice. Who had the debut album of In the Court of the Crimson King in 1969? It was King Crimson. Who wrote See Emily Play by Pink Floyd? Sid Barrett, Rick Wright, or Roger Waters? It was written by Sid Barrett. Which British rock band released the song Waterloo Sunset? The Rolling Stones, The Hollies, or The Kinks?
He was released by the Kinks. What song by Steppenwolf was featured in the 1969 film Easy Rider? The Pusher, Wasn't Born to Follow, or Born to be Wild? It was Born to be Wild. No multiple choices. Fill in the blank the lyrics from the song For Your Love by the Yardbirds. I'd give the blank and the sun for I live. I'd give the stars and the sun for I live. What song starts with the lyrics, Hello darkness, my old friend, Land of confusion, Inside the fire, The sound of silence. It was the sound of silence. Who sang Space Oddity in 1969? Mick Jagger, Freddie Mercury, or David Bowie? That was sung by David Bowie. What was the last track in the Beatles album Sgt. Pepper's Lonely Hearts Club Band? A Day in the Life, Getting Better, or She's Leaving Home? It was A Day in the Life. Which artist sang the 1960s song Twistin' the Night Away? Sam Cooke, Linda Womack, or Al Green? Sam Cooke sang Twistin' the Night Away. From what band was the song Louie Louie that was investigated by the FBI? The Sonics, The Daily Flash, The Kingsmen. It was The Kingsmen. What was the first released song of the Marvelettes? Can't Help Myself, Please Mr. Postman, or Heat Wave? Their first release song was, Please, Mr. Postman. And here is your bonus question. Who wrote the song Purple Haze in 1967? Let me know the answer in the comments. You can see the answer in the description. Thanks for playing this quiz. Don't forget to subscribe. And also, why not try these quizzes as well?